Alright, welcome back. Here I just had a simple high explosive grenade. You can also do pipe bombs um, with high explosives in a blasting cap. But basically, this is just a glue can that you use for PVC gluing. You can drill on the top with the same size uh, drill bit as the blasting cap for the fuse. Stick the blasting cap on, up on, cap up on the other side, hot glue it, then the blasting cap is attached. Fill this up with your tannerite mixture and some shrapnel, some rocks, some BBs, some metal shards, some glass, some plastic, it doesn't matter. Anything that can kill, anything that can penetrate. Um, obviously the more dense the better, um, but in a survival situation it doesn't really matter if you're just going after humans and not vehicles, which, I mean, if you're going after civilian vehicles, yes, this would pierce it. Um, obviously armored vehicles, it would not. Um, but the explosive itself will cause some damage and, and the shock will be pretty devastating depending on the size. So get that shrapnel in there, uh, tighten the lid and shake it around. You gotta be very careful because I mean, it's not super sensitive, either one of the explosives, the black powder, blasting cap or the explosive itself. So it's pretty well, but shake it around a little bit, get those mixed together and add some paint to it if you want to make it a little tactical and you're ready. That's a high explosive grenade. Um, also with pipe bombs, same thing. Uh, I'm not showing you guys how to do low explosive grenades because that's simple. That's just a fuse and uh, contain it like a pipe bomb or even this with black powder or smokeless powder. You'd have to fill it up completely. Black powder, you don't have to do that. Um, however, smokeless powder pipe bombs are very awesome to see and cause a lot of damage because of the pressure just so quickly. Um, there's, there's actually less smoke than, uh, obviously, because it's smokeless powder. When you have a smokeless powder pipe bomb, there's not much smoke. It's just a flash, and you get a bunch of shrapnel, so it almost looks like a high explosive. Um, but really, in the end, it doesn't matter. It's just um, smokeless powder is the same price, and you have to use more of it. So, um, But you can do the same thing with a pipe bomb uh, with the blasting cap type thing. This is great. This can also be used as a projectile if you put some fins on it, if you do any of those things, put a nose cone on it. Uh, this can be shot out of a cannon and with the flame from the cannon lighting this going into the sky and then blowing up a, uh, whatever you need to blow up, a helicopter or a drone, uh, an um, unarmored plane that's just some steel. Uh, definitely cause a lot of damage to that. Um, so it's just a basic high explosive grenade out of a paint or a glue can. That's all for this one. See you guys.